What is up guys, welcome back to another video. So today I actually have a sneaker unboxing. This is not a thrift video or a flea market video. But what makes this one special is this is my first ever win on the Nike sneakers app. I've had that stupid app for years and um, I have never won anything. It got to the point where I deleted it a couple months ago because I had just gave up on it. But then when they announced the Stranger Things pack, I re-downloaded it because I wanted to try to get some of those. But of course, no wins on those. I really wanted those blue blazers that came out, but of course they sold out and I didn't get them. And then one day um, I got a notification from Soul Links on Twitter that said these were dropping and they opened the raffle. I didn't even have no idea that they even were dropping that day or that they had a raffle going on. So shout outs to Soul Links on Twitter because if it wasn't for you guys, I would have never knew that these were even releasing. And since I was trying to get those blue Stranger Thing blazers, I still had the sneaker apps downloaded on my phone. So I was like, you know what? Let me go ahead and jump in there and go ahead and enter the raffle. Like I doubt I'm gonna win, but I'm gonna do it anyway because you never know. And by some miracle, I actually actually won. So if you guys have been keeping up with your sneaker releases, you know what the big drop was that happened recently. And um, I actually got a pair. So before I open it up, um, let me just start off by saying that this is stupid. Like why does Nike put their logo all over the box? This is basically just telling people, you know, there's shoes in here. Steal me. And then I don't know if it's just a personal preference, but whenever I ship out shoes and stuff, I tape all the way around the box. So that way the tape has no chance of coming up or opening. But uh, as you can see, they didn't do that. But anyway, these did get delivered yesterday. They got delivered two hours after they were supposed to be. So they arrived late. Shout out to UPS for that one. But they are here, that's all that matters. So let's go ahead and bust it open so I can show you guys what I won. And I don't even have my box cutter, so uh, let me get that real quick. All right, now let's bust it open. We got the receipt right here on top. And then it has a return label on here too, but I don't know who in their right mind would return these, but I guess you never know. After removing the receipt, you guys can see the box and um, I'm sure you know what these are already. So let's go ahead and pull these out. There you got the size tag. Air Jordan 1 Low OG SP, size 10. And these retail for 130. Um, after tax and everything, came out to like 140 something. $140 and, oh, let me check. Uh, okay, well, the receipt doesn't even have how much I paid, but I don't know, it was $140 and then like some cents. That's what they retail for. So let's go ahead and open up this box and see what we got inside. There you got the tissue paper, pink, and you got the wing logo, the Nike Air. You got the Cactus Jack logo. Opening this up. Under the pink tissue paper, there's more tissue paper. And then we got the shoes. It is the Travis Scott Jordan 1 Low. You have a really nice brown suede and then a black nubuck on the toe and the side. And you have the white leather swoosh. And then you have that off-white midsole, which I like. Um, it actually makes the shoe look nice. Then you got the red Nike Air on the tongue. Then you have black wax laces, uh, which is nice, nice touch. What I didn't know is that they came with red flat laces as well. And, um black rope laces kind of like a sb lace i knew they came with the pink laces but i didn't know they came with these black and red ones as well so that's a nice touch on the back you got the little face and then on the inside of the shoe you have the normal brown swoosh and cactus underneath that and then on the inside you got the red jump man and then cactus as well let me go ahead and pull out the other one here is the other one basically the same thing except on the back of this one you have the wing logo instead of the face then on the inside you have travis scott these have a weird smell to them. Um, I don't know how to explain it. It smells like, <coughs> you know when you walk into a nail salon or something like that? That's what it smells like. <laughs> I guess it's the glue they use, but um, it's a weird smell. And there is the size tag, a little bit different than what I'm used to seeing. So I posted these on my Instagram um, when I won them because I was pretty excited because it's the, like I said, it's the first thing I've ever won on the sneakers app. And I already had people asking if I was going to sell them. But these are going straight to my feet. Um, I'm going to be wearing these. Honestly, I'm probably going to be throwing in the pink laces and uh, they're going to go straight to foot. I know there was rumors that these were supposed to come out again in September. But then Travis Scott posted on his Instagram story that this was the only batch they're making. So the people who got them, congratulations. So I'm not sure if they are going to come out again. But I know the value did go up a little bit because of that. But like I said, I'm not going to be selling these anyway. I'm going to be wearing them. So did I get these for a crazy steal like I got my fours for? No. 
but I did pay retail for them. At the time of me filming this video, I think the last pair of these sold on StockX for 800. So to spend 140 on a pair of shoes that's worth 800, I think I'm good with that. So even though I didn't find them at the thrift or the flea market like I found these, I'm still happy paying the $140 I paid for these. I do like this colorway and I'm really happy that this was my first win on the sneaker app. I mean, I've had that stupid app for years and I've never won anything. I've entered so many raffles. Um, and everything that was first come first serve was always gone like that. So yeah, I mean, I thought I was never gonna win anything to be honest. <laughs> I don't know where I would rank these among my favorite Travis Scott shoes, um, but I know for sure these are still my favorite. Just the colorway and everything on these I really love. In my opinion, these are a dope shoe. They're not as bad as people are making them out to be. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this quick sneaker unboxing video. I want to share with you guys my first ever win on the sneakers app. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. It lets me know. Drop a comment down below and subscribe, and I will see you guys soon with another video. So, later.